welcome back dear friends and students in this video i am going to show installation of quiet universal circuit simulator in short qucs on windows operating system let's see how to use qucs on windows first let's see how to download the software open any browser in this case i am going to open google chrome here i am going to type qucs for windows so this is the link which i am going to open now to download software on windows click on third link here qucs portable for windows so let me download the latest version to download the latest version click on download latest version it will start downloading within a short time so here it started downloading which will take about 1 minute to download depending upon the internet speed let's wait till it gets downloaded once it is downloaded i'll open the download folder so here this is a zip file let me cut this and move to d drive where i am going to make a one new folder with the name qucs so here i am going to paste this and afterwards let me right click this and click on extract all let me extract the complete folder in a same location so here we can see this is a zipped file and it's been extracted here so after opening this to use qcs just open this windows batch file either double clicking or pressing the enter button so this is the window where you can work first click on new and write the name of new project i write it as a test and click on create i'm going to construct a simple circuit to show you the execution let me go to components here i'll take two resistor let me place one here and another here by double clicking the value i'll change the value of this resistor to 1000 ohm and here also i'll change it to 1000 ohm or you can write it as 1k which is 1000 ohm and i'll use a one source go to sources here take a dc source and right click to rotate it so here i have rotated and let me place this and take a wire and let me connect this the detailed explanation of how to connect a circuit has been given in one of the video go to the description to understand the detailed explanation so let me take this ground point and now this value i'll change it instead of 1 volt to 2 volts go to simulations and i'll select a dc simulation later so let me save this go to file press on save or you can press control s and here i'll give test circuit as a name and to see the simulation say what i do say just to calculate dc bias i'll click on dc bias here you can see dear students and friends it is 2 volts across this there will be 1 volt because the potential at this point is 2 volts and the potential at this point is 1 volt if at all you want to connect meters you can go to a probes and take a voltage probe and you can connect a voltage meter let me connect positive to this terminal and negative to this terminal 
so it should show one volt and even i'll take a one current probe and to connect current probe so i'll disconnect this because it has to be connected in series and let me connect a current meter and later i'll connect a wire to this because it should be in a series connection so now let me save this and once again go to simulation and once again calculate dc bias you can see dear students the current through this is 1 milliampere because the voltage is 2 volts divided by 2 kilo ohm is equal to 1 milliampere to understand how to simulate all the circuit in detail you go to the description of this video where i have given the links i have explained everything in detail i have done this video just to show the installation of qcs on windows operating system hope this is clear to all of you dear friends and students thank you thank you for watching